today is a work slash errands day. I'm trying to see how I can fit in some party prepping things for doing surprise birthday party that I will be hosting. Um, on my way to, we'll have to go to Price Mart to get liquor, and then I want to go to this clothing store that I saw on Instagram called Closet Code. It's actually close by to where I work so I plan to just hop in there because I need to get a skirt to wear with uh, a top that I already have. I bought this Zara top like a few months ago and I haven't gotten a chance to wear it as yet so I want to wear that to the party. But I need a skirt. I kind of have a, a, not a skirt that I could wear, but it just not hit it like on, yeah, the outfit not banging. <laughs> um, so I'm going to try to see if I can get this skirt from the store. I already saw the skirt on their website and I called them yesterday and I have it in stock. So it's pretty much to just pop in and try on the two sizes that I have and see which one. But yeah, so first stop is Price Mart. So one of the things that I wanted to get is like full grass. So let me show you guys. Because the area that I'm having the party, it it like it's dirt so i want it covered so you know it looks a little bit also i think i'm gonna use full grass to kind of cover it so let me show you and i'm thinking i'm saving a peep of a daily party bailey's party I was looking to see if I could use their plates like but yeah this is kind of not what I'm going for and these just thin so you know say only for food can't even hold on that properly but I think I can use these cups So I'm done with Price Mart now. So you know, good old sanitizer. Alright, so the next stop I'm going to the clothing store to pick up the skirt. Yeah, so Price Mart was somewhat successful. I didn't get a lot of the alcohol um, or liquor that I needed. I haven't gotten any red stripe beer, any Appleton or anything like that. So I'm gonna figure out where I'm going to get those stuff from but we still have some time so we should be fine for the event I should be able to get them before then so let's head to the store
the medium seems like it's it. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Oh. So I got the skirt I wanted. I just left Closet Code. It's the first time I'm actually shopping in that store. And uh, it was such a good experience. The customer service was so good. The store is so cute. And they have some really, really nice stuff. Um, I know a lot of clothing stores now, you know, especially like local clothing, clothing store is boutique online stores but it was nice being able to go into a store that like the decor is just perfect and customer service is perfect it, it was just a lovely lovely experience and i will definitely be checking them out again like oh i'm still in birthday preparation mode this is the night before the party and i'm currently blowing up balloons well i'm i'm done now I'm done with the jumbo ones. I'm blowing up balloon for a balloon garland that I would love to do. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it tomorrow, depending on the plans for the surprise. But yeah, I am exhausted. I had so much going on today in terms of trying to get everything prepared. But so far, he has no clue what's going on. He was kind of annoyed <laughs> when I said I had to leave and go by my friend's house um, tonight to chill when really, of course, I'm coming to blow the balloons for the garland. But yeah, I'm trying to just head back home so he doesn't really get, you know, annoyed by me being out so late. Um, yeah so we are doing this and i'm just like i really hope it works out because i had to change plans my initial plan was for him to leave the house to like have a friend invite him over to watch football or something but that didn't work out so he's actually going to be at home in our apartment and we're having the party at our apartment complex so my job is to keep him inside the house i just really hope say him not have no reason like to say okay i need to go to my car for something or any other reason why i'm feeling him need to leave the apartment because if he was supposed to leave he's going to see the preparation taking place and probably end up seeing people and that would just ruin everything and it would just make my job extra hard trying to convince him to stay inside but yeah that's what the plan is going to be but that works out because then it gives us time to actually get ready and for him to actually get ready because what i'm going to do i told him that i have i made reservations out of town for us to have lunch and my sister-in-law is going to pick up bailey yeah so that's that's the plan that we're running with and just I'm just hoping that it goes smoothly I just wish I could be a part of like the setting up and so on but I will just have to be in the apartment with him keeping him there so yeah if I don't get to check in before well I'm going to try to see if I can check in before like while probably while I'm getting ready before the surprise but we'll see because i don't want to give away too much 
yeah so that's what's happening i'm really excited though because it's the first time he's going to be surprised with anything really and i'm just like really excited to see his reaction because like there's no one that's more deserving of this and i'm happy i'm happy i'm happy i'm happy i'm happy i'm excited and i'm looking forward to tomorrow so yeah i'm going to head home now and try to get some rest because we have a long and exciting day tomorrow i have the liquor we have everything ready food set dj like the bartender it's going to be a good time i'm manifesting a beautiful fun filled day currently getting ready for the surprise party he doesn't know yet so i'm gonna pretend that i'm vlogging this organic yes all right welcome back to another vlog so today we are heading out to celebrate Dwayne's birthday um so i'm actually in the process of finalizing my makeup i should have kind of started recording before but like in the middle i'm like why am i not recording right but yes yeah, so we well time is going we're heading out of town Dwayne doesn't really know where we're going well he doesn't know where we're going he says that he hates surprises uh, but i love surprises like how can you hate surprises like you know but he says he doesn't like surprises but i'm surprising him and taking him out of town so we'll see how that go so i'm good i'm going to finish up my makeup and then check back in to show you guys what i'm wearing so I'm all dressed and ready to leave. I'm wearing this top that I got from Zara and this skirt that I bought from Closet Code. But yeah, and these earrings that I had for a while now that I got from my friend Lenine. I've had them for years, love them. So yeah, and my Ferragamo bag. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing. And we're ready and he still doesn't know where we're going <laughs> babe you want to come and guess where we're going I don't know, babe. I'm not good at guessing. what you mean you're not good at guessing you don't give me no idea which direction I mean. let me put him on camera the birthday boy any guesses somewhere nice that's the only guess that's all right which parish at least saint anne saint anne okay and i don't know really saint anne, but why so. you don't like surprises just not my thing baby are we ready yeah um so we're gonna leave the clothes right as well <laughs> all right all right let me go put them up and then we can head out sometimes i can you took up your purse yeah it's in my bag yes, oh you know say something they said we should huh um better was saying we should stop by just say hi actually just have to stop by and say hi hmm? Party, you tell me to stop by and say hi. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, but we're saying hi. Hey. hey. Yeah. What's up? Yeah. Oh. That one cousin, Tony. Which cousin? Oh, that's Tony. Yeah. How do you feel about your surprise? I love it.
Thank you. <laughs> All right, everyone. So the party's over. It was a success. Dwayne was surprised. I had so much fun. It was just a really, really good evening. And I couldn't be more grateful. And yeah, hopefully, you know, we have more celebrations that we can record on the vlog. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this one. Keep watching, keep subscribing, sharing. I appreciate you all. <laughs> all right, bye, bye. On our way to celebrate Dwayne's birthday. Today is officially his birthday, so we're going out to dinner. And I am excited because we're going to a new restaurant, which I've not tried before. Okay, so this is the first appetizer, and this is which one, babe? The shrimp dumpling. Shrimp chicken gyoza. So it's basically chicken dumpling. Steamed. Chicken gyoza. Chicken gyoza. And, and this one is what? Crispy rice dynamite. So this is crispy rice dynamite. this the crispy rice is really really delicious like the flavor is just mm. 
party so good gotten to the end of Dwayne's birthday celebrations like all of them like the big party and no birthday dinner so babe let's give your true review thoughts on the week wasn't this the it's thought in the camera what doing just literally spoil the video babe you babe. make a post is just saying oh yeah you know want with you're the editor don't it anyway i fully enjoyed my weekend and my birthday uh, well so far it's my week so <laughs> what we mean like by week wednesday thursday friday and saturday to complete it right that's a very great start <laughs> You know People. was good. The party was wonderful. I'm more to come. Listen, is it a stress? What I have to deal with? I created a monster. My husband used to be so humble and not big on anything. And you know, you just give my little boss and look at this. Oh boy, wants like an entire week long celebration. But that's it for this vlog. I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. March has just been a very eventful month for me. Like all of my friends and loved ones seem like they need for born in a March. But yeah, it's been it's been a good month. All events have been successful and I'm happy. And thank you guys for watching and tuning into, you know, my life. Bye.